Of course people come. Sometimes girls come on their own, sometimes they come with their friends. Sometimes parents come. Sometimes even the boyfriend can bring them because they want restoration of uh, virginity so that they can get married due to various reasons. If it is a boyfriend, it might be that the parents or the relatives want to see bloodshed on the wedding night. Oh, it might be that the relationship is ending due to whatever reason, perhaps the social uh, reasons and uh, the girl is going to get married to somebody else and uh, therefore it is important that she has, that she can demonstrate that she has been a pure girl and that uh, she will bleed uh, on her wedding night. Not at all. We do not agree with this. Virginity is not purity. Virginity, is, of course, is a part of your body and it's the right of a girl to be able to decide what she wants to do with it. The problem is more complex and complicated because this is a culture bound anomaly that we have in this country. A girl is considered pure if she sheds blood, if there's bleeding on wedding night and if that does not happen then she is thought to be not a virgin and the society doesn't condone that practice of premarital sex. I'm not saying that just because you were your hymen doesn't break that, that means you are impure in certain places, cases. You can have a congenital situation or congenital uh, problem in your hymen where it doesn't tear or it doesn't bleed. However, this bleeding equating with Purity is not a concept that we agree with at all. We disagree with that. And we actually contribute to the gradual uh, decay or gradual disappearance of this concept because people know that virginity can be restored and therefore even if you see bloodshed, it can be a virginity that has been restored. So we are hoping that eventually, one day, people will not be looking for virginity like in other countries, say for instance America or England. <laughs>